Hello there guys, my name is Ono Ogi and these are my thoughts on Modern Warfare 3 so far. In the background you can see Cena and there's gameplay, he's running around, around with a UMP killing people. I'm also going to show you some gameplay from Hutch and Sark. Let's start talking about the graphics. The graphics, it looks like Modern Warfare 2's graphic uh, settings, but I think that's going to be a nice thing to be honest. I I don't have a problem with reusing graphics because it's familiar, you're gonna be able to jump into the game and start killing people without any problem. It's gonna be like playing Modern Warfare 2, but a big difference from Modern Warfare 3 to Modern Warfare 2 is that there's gonna be, they're gonna take away three major perks from the game. And it's ca Commando, uh, Woman Army and Last Stand. It's gonna be gone from the game, so that's an improvement, it's gonna be much more balanced now. We're surely gonna find something new to bitch about, but that's for the future to see, because right now it looks awesome. I don't see anything that looks overpowered, or uh, neither Seananders or Hutch or Sark said anything about anything being overpowered. Uh, I don't think it's gonna be as balanced as Black Ops was, but we have yet to see, to be honest. They're, they're, they're moving forward to a good balanced game by taking away those free perks, so that's nice. Uh, I don't know what weapon Sinners is using now, I think that is one of the new machine pistols and they also said that the machine pistols are, pistols are not gonna be that overpowered anymore. In the background right now it's Mr. Sark's gameplay, he's running around with the bear with 50 cal, uh, I think he's gonna pick up an M4 soon, yeah he's picking up an M4, I think that's an M4, I'm not sure, it's silenced and with an ACOG side or red dot and that's pretty nice because to be able to do things like that, to put two attachment attachments on your weapon, you're gonna be able to level up your weapons. You're gonna have levels with each of your weapons, and the further you go in the levels, you're gonna be able to uh, uh, put like two attachments on the weapon, uh, silencer and ACOG or something like that. So that's really really nice that they're putting in some levels in the game, so you have something more to do than just prestige. You can actually level up weapons and get better with them. What more is new? Uh, there's gonna be classes in game and don't it's not gonna be World of Warcraft. Oh my god, I'm a mage It's not gonna be like that, but it's gonna be three different classes like assault support and defending uh, and for if you pick like an assault class you're gonna get some assault like kill streaks that you get a lot more kills for if you take a defending defending class you're gonna be able to like maybe put down turrets that takes away rockets or gets down air support or something like that and if you take uh, support you're gonna be able to put out uh, life wests and shit for people to use so they don't get killed as fast and things like that I think in uh, the next gameplay now yeah Hutch's gameplay uh, he's running around with the L96A1 and that's awesome he's also gonna soon show us some new support uh, kill streak that puts out li life uh, wests on the ground or uh, protective wests against bullets on the ground here you can see it is running around uh, ballistic west and that's pretty nice you're gonna be able to help your teammates out not in an overpowered way but in a good way uh, here's a <laughs> die camber die uh, I don't know what weapon this is but it looks it looks like a UMP but it's not I know it's not because C9, C9 was using UMP before but it looks pretty nice that weapon it looks like uh, drop shot is gonna be in the game he just did it uh, you're gonna be able to drop shot. Uh, dolphin diving is not in the game anymore. I don't think I haven't seen anyone dolphin dive. Don't think that's gonna be a major difference. I was mainly using dolphin diving in Black Ops for like getting away from grenades and so forth. So that's gonna be nice. Uh, what more? I I have yet to see like claimers and such. I want to see how good they are, because in Modern Warfare, uh, in Black Ops, it was insanely hard to get away from a Claymore. Not like in Modern Warfare 2, you can actually jump away from it. Uh, here we're gonna watch Hutch put out uh, what's it called? It's called a Predator missile. It's gonna be awesome to see Predator missiles again, not the fucking RCXD car, RCXD or fuck it's called. It's gonna be nice. So these were my thoughts about Modern Warfare 3 so far, if it comes to anything major new I'm gonna talk about that. Thanks for listening to my annoying voice and this was Ono, ono Ogi, peace out.